into taverns with ordinary folk. Leave it. Sultan. Get out. About those cards. You got them? Got the Isengrim card. Sure do you. Ha! I see hells are beautiful. Zed give you much trouble? Zed's dead. I ran into his murderers. Won't cry over spilt Zed. What about the other cards? Sultan, sure this business isn't getting a little too dangerous? I mean, men are dying over these cards. Just Zed. And believe you me, he wasn't an innocent bystander. Besides, I'm certain he snuffed his killers out on the spot. So why worry? Tell me about the other cards instead. Didn't find the other cards. Fuck! Bugger must have sold them. Listen, got Zed's ledger. Show me. Hmm. Entries show him selling the cards to Caesar Bilson and Ravi. Uh, could have been worse. We need to pay him a visit. Ravi? Who's he? A common card sharp and a swindler. Boggles my mind where he got the coin for the Natalis card. Ever since I gave him a smack and things between us have been frosty, so you'll have to see him alone. Who's Caesar Bilzin? Cleaver's clerk. A decent fellow once, but so high and mighty now you can't drink with him, let alone go fishing. Fishing? We met at the Angler's Club, the pride of the Ponta. But Caesar don't show around there no more. So caught up in his new role, he almost never leaves his house. At least we won't have to run around town looking for him. Zoltan, seems awful important to you. I'll try to get you those cards. Thanks, Geralt. We can see Caesar together. Meet me outside his townhouse. Gaudiest eyesore in Hierarch Square. He had the facade painted gold. And if you want to see Ravi first, I'd look for him at the Golden Sturgeon if I were you. All right. See you later. And no need to pussyfoot around with Ravi. Beat him about the ears a bit. He'll cave. Well, good luck to you, Geralt. Your son, Jost. May he take after his father. There will be a mill. <laughs> As they say, a bard must be a quick talker and a witcher.
rolls in a lap. I'm afraid to see Just the let that refuse into tavern. Leave it. You're not on duty. A new rice takes you're a bigger rat bigger than me. Starving in Bazima, you know. They eat horse carcasses. How about that? It's the flea ridden mutant. Join us, please. Ravi loves company. Look how happy he is to see us. You happy, Ravi? Sure he'd be happier if you stopped digging the point of that dagger in his back. Oh, you're just saying that because you don't know the situation. Our mutual friend Ravi here was just about to play for his life and... Uh... Oh, you got the card! What else do you want? If you'd just given it up, instead of trying to cheat us, we'd be out of your hair already. As it is, that's all your fingers broken. So, it seems the Witcher will have to play for you. Sound good? Ah! See? Rav is on board. What do you say we add some spice to the game? Raise the stakes. Ravi's life and the Natalis card. Fancy that? Agreed. <laughs> and here I thought you'd be no fun at all. Let's play! Let's play! His long search for Ciri led Geralt to conclude that Uma, the ugliest man alive and the victim of a curse, was the key to finding the young woman.
Oh, cow. Sure, he'd be. Oh, Ow, if you just get. Uh, uh, see? Agreed. <laughs> Let's. Yes! Curb your enthusiasm, mate. And sit still, or you'll hurt yourself. But... But he won! So, now we'll play something else. Gotta got you clean, you... Show me what you got. Thanks. Don't know how I'll repay you. The tallest card will do just fine. Oh, yeah. Uh, maybe you prefer some other? Got a whole array you might like. I'm in a hurry. The Natalis card, of course. Here.
What'll it be? What are you serving? Farewell. What'll it be? What are you serving? Not hungry, not thirsty, but I sure wouldn't mind a round of Gwent.